Ladies and gentlemen, Joshua, a CFO, a graduate of the Bachelor of Communication Studies degree, will respond on behalf of the student body. Nga mihi atu ki e koutou mō tēnei rā, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou katoa. Talo falava, whakalofala i atu gia matolo osi. Before I jump into the speech, I want to honour and give thanks to a couple of key people here at AUT. The Chancellor, the Vice-Chancellor, the Dean for, for the Faculty of Design and Creative Technologies, distinguished guests, and of course to the families and support people who are here today. A special shout out to my grandparents. Uh, also a special shout out to my TV family. And also a special, and a special shout out to Michaela Hall from radio because she asked for one. <laughs> when I was two years old, I took my first step. My parents were stoked. I was able to stay afloat in this world that they hoped wouldn't sink me blue. I first started walking at the age of two. When I was eight years old, I got told that I couldn't walk properly. My older cousin, who was 11, said that I needed to be a bit more thug. He said, widen your stride, tilt your head up high, not too high though, that's not cool, bro. Sway with your chest. Look left, look right, look right, look left, no swipe, thug life. <laughs> it never really stuck. When I was 13 years old, I didn't know who I was. Stuck in between two mirrors, still un unable to tell you who was in my reflection, I always walked with my head face towards the floor. Insecure of my identity, I walked with my tail in between my legs where pegs and they hung on the line. I felt like I was walking on the line. I felt like my walk wasn't mine. When I was 18 years old, I walked into AUT. Fresh out of high school with a dream in my head and determination in my back pocket like a rocket, I flew into my degree, not caring about gravity, it was me and AUT. When I was 20 years old, I found some people to walk with. Brothers and sisters from different walks of life in my class, and today is our last walk. Hello, my name is Joshua Hilbafa Jacob Siope Yosefo. I am Samoan Nguyen. I was born and raised in South Auckland. <laughs> I'm 21 years old, and today I graduate with the Bachelors of Communications, majoring in television and screen production. I guess what I'm trying to say is that we all have our own walk. We all come from different walks of life. But there are two journeys that unite us today. The first is our walk through AUT, and the second is our walk across the stage. Whoever you are, wherever you have walked from, and wherever you're walking to, even if it's not walking, if it's hopping, or, or rolling, or wheeling, <laughs> I'm talking to you too. It has been a privilege to walk with you. When we walk across the stage, we are saying, we did it. When we walk across the stage, we are saying, we made it. When we walk across the stage, we walk in victory. When we walk across the stage, we carry our ancestors on our shoulders. When we walk across the stage, we walk with one foot following the other, grounding ourselves in this earth that is ours for the changing. When we walk across the stage, we grab the hands of our whanau, our yinga, our family, and take them with us side by side. When we walk across the stage, we receive more than a piece of paper. We receive a piece of paper that validates our peace to give back towards world peace. When we walk across the stage, some of us shut down statistics that said that we would never have taken the first step when we walk across the stage we honor our mothers our fathers our grandparents and become role models to our younger sisters and brothers and sons and daughters when we walk across the stage we tell the world that we are prepared to walk the distance when we walk across the stage we walk over adversity and stop out that small voice that told us to give up when we walk across the stage this stage is not a stage but the starting line of a lifelong race where the only finish line 
is changing someone else's life. Now, Now, that I'm 21 years old, I walk with my eyes faced high towards the sky and my heart deeply anchored in every step I take. And as one foot follows the other, I walk knowing that I've had the privilege of spending the last three years of my life walking with all of you. Thank you students and lecturers for walking with me. And in the famous words of DJ Unk, staying true to my South Auckland roots, yeah. walk it out. <laughs> Congratulations to all the AUT graduates of 2015. For Fitaya Tele Moleau Vanua, Vi'ia Liatua, Ma'ia Auto Manuia. Thank you. Thank you.